Welcome to Byte Further. In today's video, you'll learn how to fix an iPhone 12 that keeps restarting itself. When your screen starts freezing and your iPhone 12 keeps restarting on and off randomly on its own, don't lose hope. With advanced technology and materials, your iPhone 12 is pretty tough and long-lasting. And the reasons why your iPhone 12 keeps restarting itself can vary based on the circumstances. Sometimes the iPhone 12 auto restart problem appears because the iOS system is interrupted by unknown bugs. For example, errors or malware come from unsecured third-party apps and unsafe websites. In other instances, the culprit can be a failed iOS update or restore process. Other common issues like low storage memory space and charging problems can also cause your iPhone 12 to keep restarting every 3 minutes or all the time. In rare cases, this constant and automatic restart problem could crop up because liquid managed to seep inside of the device, or, perhaps, the phone took a hard fall off a table or out of your pocket. Regardless, there are some troubleshooting steps you can try out to see whether it's possible to fix the iPhone 12 keeps restarting over and over. Step 1, do a forced restart. Doing a forced restart and clearing the system cache is a go-to troubleshooting step when your iPhone 12 keeps rebooting. You can do this by pressing a combo of buttons. Best of all, including the system cache, the unknown errors and bugs that make your device restart randomly will be also wiped clean after a forced restart. Here's how for an iPhone 12, iPhone 12 mini, iPhone 12 Pro, and iPhone 12 Pro Max. Quickly press then release volume up button, volume down button, and then press the side button and hold it for a while. The device should turn off. Still keep holding the side button. After around 10 to 15 seconds, Apple logo will come up. Now, release the button. Just wait a few seconds and thereafter, your device should boot up and show the lock screen. You can try this a few more times if it doesn't work at once. Step 2, take out the SIM card and do a forced restart. Do you insert a SIM card in your iPhone 12? If you do, it may not be compatible with your system. Now. Try to take out the SIM card to get your iPhone 12 out of the constant restarting loop. Prepare a SIM card removal tool or a small paper clip. Insert it into the small pinhole next to the SIM card tray. Apply a bit of pressure until the tray pops out. Gently pull the SIM card tray out of the iPhone 12. Then, force reboot your device. Quickly press then release volume up button, volume down button, and then press the side button and hold it until you see the Apple logo. Now. See if your iPhone 12 stops restarting constantly on its own. Step 3, Unplug Charging Cables or Other External Devices If your iPhone 12 keeps restarting when charging, then, the culprit might be a faulty charging cable or charger. Now, unplug the charging cables. Make sure that no external devices are connected to your device. Also, if your iPhone 12 wears a screen protector or phone case, take it off. Then, Press the buttons to force restart your device and check if it goes back to normal status. Step 4, Delete faulty apps if any. If you run into the issue that iPhone 12 keeps rebooting Apple logo especially when you open the particular app, first of all, see if there is an update on the Apple App Store. If yes, update the app and see if the restarting loop issue is fixed. If not, try to delete the app. Go and find the app on your iPhone home screen. Press and hold the app icon. Tap Remove App. Tap Delete App. Tap Delete to confirm. Now, see if you manage to fix the endless restart on iPhone 12. Step 5, Stop iPhone 12 from restarting via Recovery Mode. All iPhones come with a Recovery Mode feature that lets Apple's official software iTunes or Finder fix the software-related issues on the device even when it's unusable. In this mode, you can do a system update or restore on the device through a computer. If you choose to upgrade the iOS software, all your data is still intact and will become visible to you after the update. If you choose to restore the device to its factory settings, all your data and content will be removed, as well as the settings. Let's start with the update method. If it won't help, you can't take the restore option as a last resort. Now, let's start. Connect the USB cable to your iPhone 12 and plug another end of the USB port into the computer. Double-click iTunes or Finder software to open it up. Next. Grab your iPhone 12 and press some button combinations to go into recovery mode. Quickly press the volume up button then release. Quickly press the volume down button then release. 
Press the power button and keep holding it for a few seconds. Keep holding the power button even when you see the Apple logo screen. When you see a computer, a USB cable, and a link showing up on a black screen, release the power button. It's a recovery mode screen. iTunes or Finder on your computer can quickly connect to an iPhone in recovery mode without needing confirmation on the phone. Now, go back to the computer and take a look at the iTunes or Finder screen. A message dialog box should have popped up, just like this. It gives you two options, update and restore. So, click the update button first and follow the on-screen instructions. Wait for the update to finish. After that, see if your iPhone 12 works normally after rebooting. If not, repeat all the steps again and click the restore button to wipe clean your device. Note that this will delete everything on your phone, so consider twice before you go. That's all how to fix iPhone 12 that keeps restarting on its own. Hope this video can help fix the auto restart problems and get your device out of the rebooting loop quickly. If it does, please give it a thumbs up and share it via Facebook, Twitter, and so on to help others in need. Also, if you have any further questions, feel free to write them down in the comments below and I'll reply ASAP. To learn more tech tips about iPhones, subscribe to the Byte Further channel. Now, you can click another video on the screen to keep watching.